Hello kids! Welcome to Online Awesome Kids. Thank you for joining us today. Before we begin, let us first dance and sing praise to God. Now together, let's do the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Happy Sunday, awesome kids! We miss you so much, and soon we hope to see you face to face. In the meantime, let's talk about our last lesson, then we'll proceed with our lesson for today. Last video, we heard the story about Abel and Cain. Cain was jealous of Abel, and he didn't listen to God. Cain's sin led to him being sent away from enjoying fellowship with God. We learned that envy separates us from our loved ones. Sin breaks God's heart and it separates us from God. To avoid sin, let's always keep in mind that the Lord loves all of us and is always giving us what we need. You can still watch this on our YouTube channel. Now, before we start our lesson, let's first pray our favorite awesome kids prayer. Heavenly Father, the Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Dear Jesus, I love you. Bring me close to you. I want to please you, Jesus. Everything I do, hear me, Jesus. I work in my place. Say to me, I love you, Jesus. More and more each day. Father God, thank you for gathering and meeting our kids today. Send your Holy Spirit as we honor you and celebrate your goodness inside our homes. Bless our activity today, Lord. Open our hearts and minds. Use us, Lord, to bring the light of Jesus to others. All this we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Now, kids, let's enjoy your lesson. Hello awesome kids! Welcome to the third talk of our series, Blessing and Curse. Our big message is, Your God Weeps. Now, let's continue our story from Genesis. After Cain was sent away, he founded a city. But soon, violence spread and the whole earth became bad. God became very sad about his world. The people were bad and unkind. The only good people left were Noah and his family. 
God told Noah that a great flood was coming. So Noah and his three sons went to work building an enormous ark. The cruel people laughed at Noah, but he did not mind them. When the ark was finished, God told Noah to round up and take on board pairs of animals that lived on earth. Two elephants, two zebras, two lions, two of every kind. Hurry up, Noah said. The rain is beginning to fall. Then the rain began to fall harder and harder until the ark was afloat. It rained for 40 days and 40 nights, and the water of the flood covered the whole earth. At last, the rain stopped. Noah sent out a dove, and it returned with a green leaf on its beak. This told Noah that the flood was going down and there was some dry land. The ark gently came to rest on a mountain top. Then Noah opened the door and all the birds and animals came out. Noah thanked God for keeping his family and the animals safe. God put a rainbow in the sky as a sign of hope and promised that he will not destroy the earth again by water. Wow! Did you like the story? Noah is faithful and obedient to God. God blessed Noah and his family. But let's go back to our big message. Your God weeps. What does it mean? It means that God cries when we make mistakes, when we sin. Just like in our story, the Lord became very, very, very sad that the good people he created became bad and unkind. If we choose to sin, just like the people in our story, our sin will become our punishment. Example, our parents are always telling us not to eat too much sweets. But if we don't listen, guess what? Later on, we'll get painful tooth decay. God is giving us a choice to be good or bad. What will you choose? I hope you learned something today. Happy Sunday! Hello kids! In our story, God created a rainbow as a sign of hope. Today, let's make a rainbow craft to remind us that God loves us and will always keep us safe. Just like how he got Noah, his family, and his animals safe. Let's gather the materials that we will need. Paper, pen or markers, coloring materials. Let's start. Get your paper and draw a big rainbow. At the bottom, write down, God loves me. Color the rainbow in this order, starting from the top. Red, then orange. Yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. You can add more decorations if you like. And that's it! Share with us what you've made by posting a photo or video and post this in the comment section of our Facebook page. See you next Sunday! Hello awesome kids! We hope you had fun while learning today's lesson. Before we end, let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, thank you for always protecting our family. Keep our family united in loving and praying for other families too. Protect all our doctors, nurses, and frontliners. Keep them safe so that they may continue saving lives. We also pray for the continuous healing of our world. All of this we ask in Jesus' mighty name, through the intercession of Mary our Mother, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Bye! We miss you! Stay safe and see you next Sunday!